Ramon Fonseca, a co-founder of Mosaic Fonseca, confirmed to Panama's Channel 2 television network that the leaked Panama papers were authentic and had been illegally obtained through hacking. He described the hack and leak as an international campaign against privacy. The documents cover a period of over almost 40 years, from 1977 until as recently as last December. The papers allegedly show that some companies domiciled in tax havens were being used for suspected money laundering, arms and drug deals and tax avoidance. The documents are at the centre of an investigation published on Sunday by the International Consortium of Investigative Journalists, the German newspaper Süddeutsche Zeitung, SZ, and more than a hundred other news organisations around the globe. According to SZ's findings, 12 current and former heads of state 200 other politicians, as well as members of various mafia organizations, plus football stars, 350 major banks, and hundreds of thousands of regular citizens were among Mozak Fonseca's clients. Now, the law firm, who has more than 40 offices worldwide, specialized in the sale of anonymous offshore companies known as shell firms. The Argentine president, Iceland's prime minister, Saudi Arabia's King Salman, and the UAE and Ukrainian presidents are among those named in the documents as having set up shell companies. Relatives and associates of other leaders, including Russia's Vladimir Putin, China's Xi Jinping and Britain's David Cameron, were also identified by the team of reporters that examined the documents. Now, although many of the allegations made in the Panama Papers are yet to be confirmed, the far-reaching repercussions of the massive leak are expected to continue to surface in the weeks to come.